some people use density-based uh, clustering, so DB scan, but it's a hierarchical DB scan. So it's basically you take your UMAP, your TSNI, whatever, and you identify clusters where the density in this 2D space is high. I think it's still probably not the best way. What you have to be aware of is that UMAP is a visualization and you compress maybe, you start with 20 or 30,000 dimensions, you go down to 50 dimensions and you compress it down to two dimensions. And you can't compress everything down to two dimensions without losing some information, even though UMAP does an excellent job of representing the data. There is a big risk of compressing something. It's actually the case if you try sometimes to run UMAP in three dimensions, you might see more resolution than you had in two dimensions. And when you start doing clustering in two dimensions, uh, uh, you might run into problems. Uh, it is it is still used. I realized like in the Monocle package, they used density-based clustering on uh, UMAP, for instance. And I still believe, but I don't have any proof for it, that the graph, if you have your SNN graph, that better represents all diversity you have in your data compared to the UMAP pressed down on two dimensions. 